Now I'm very pleased with my uh, street workout setup and tomorrow is my birthday so this is sort of like as a present. I'm happy that I've completed it before my birthday and uh, tomorrow I'll be able to do a birthday workout so I'll try to surpass myself and hopefully I'll move, show everything, um, all the moves that I can do and uh, yeah, it's great really. Yo, I'm on the Fitstoner here and yesterday I built myself a scaffolding gym, uh, just a dip bar and pull up bar really, that's all I needed. Uh, as they're quite old and rusty, I'm going to polish them up to give it a, a neat look and uh, not it being too rough on the hands. So yeah, let's do it. Bang! So here is one of the pieces of scaffolding, as you can see, very rusty and on the hands. Uh, it's not pleasant at all, especially for calluses and stuff like that. So I'm going to file it down and uh, make it all shiny. Today I'm going to show you my home gym that I built yesterday uh, out of scaffolding. Uh, it's not the best. Uh, I need to add on more to it and uh, it will be better in the future. So I have here a dip station, two bars. I'll file them down just now so no sharp edges on these scaffolding poles. I've got one pull up bar at the moment. I will be shortly adding one at the top here, from here, so over here and uh, yeah that's about it really I uh, made myself a home gym out of scaffolding and uh, I feel pretty proud of myself <laughs> alright so yesterday I filed, uh, I filed these scaffolding poles down so no sharp edges um, on them I did three of them I will be cutting some more poles to put one between here and another one here as uh, these ones are fairly close together and uh, I can't do any wide pull-ups so I'm gonna cut these scaffolding poles and uh, file them down and uh, set everything up okay so I have cut and filed the necessary poles now all I need to do is attach them make them level and at the right height and we'll be done Let's do that. Alright guys, this is the last one I'm going to put on and this is going to be the main one that I will use for pull-ups and stuff like that. Whew. Last one, last one.
Okay, this looks fairly done. Uh, let's try it now. Hopefully it doesn't fall on me. First must fill up on my home gym, my guys. <laughs> yes! And here we are. I know I keep calling it a home gym and I should say more like a home street workout uh, setup. But uh, it's finally finished, guys. Fold all the ones that I'll be using, putting my hands on. Uh, so they're all smooth. Uh, yeah, it looks pretty good. I've got a dip station, a pull up bar here that will be that has no um, structure in the side of it, so I can swing and do stuff. Hopefully, I'll be able to do freestyle on this dip station. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Never used a dip station before, never done dips, so hopefully, this chest is going to get even bigger. And uh, yeah, that's about it, really. Peace out.